Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to check a new motor from a new company named Flywoo. In this video I'm going to go over the specifications of this motor, then I'm going to measure its thrust using my motor thrust stand and soon I'm going to feature it in a build video. In case you haven't heard about Flywoo, they are a new company that was recently established. Currently they are selling two types of motors, a couple of frames, a flight controller which I'm going to review soon, Kevlar straps, and I'm pretty sure that soon they are going to expand their line of products. The NIN motor, which by the way stands for Ninja, is available in two sizes and three KV options. The 2306 version is available both in gold and in silver, and the golden version costs $2 more due to the special coating. The 1750 KV version is compatible with up to 6S LiPo batteries, the 2450 KV version, which is the one I'm going to test in this video, is compatible with up to 5S LiPo batteries, and finally, the 2750 kV version is compatible with up to 4S LiPo batteries. Along with the motor that comes inside this nice black box, you get in some stickers and also 4 M3 screws along with a propeller nut that matches the color of the motor. The motor, including the propeller nut, weighs 35.47 grams. It is using 18 AWG silicone wires with a total length of 15 centimeters. The distance between the mounting holes is 16 millimeters, and as expected from a premium motor, the motor bell is secured using a hex screw. The next thing I'm going to do is to bench test this motor using 3, 4 and 5S type of batteries, and I'll see you in a bit in order to go over the results. As you can see, pretty much as expected, this is a powerful and also power hungry motor. The maximum measured thrust on 3S was 910 grams, on 4S 1526 grams, and 5S close to 1700 grams. In addition, the maximum measured current on 5S was 37 amperes and 32.2 amperes on 4S, so I recommend to use 40 amperes ESCs along with this motor. So overall, if you're looking for a powerful motor that will add some bling to your build, I think that you should definitely check out the NIN 2306 motor. And soon I'm going to test it out when I'm going to build the Gepro C Mark III, which I recently reviewed. As always, I thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. If you have any questions about the NIN 2306 motor, feel free to ask it in the comment section down below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you like this video and consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell if you're not already subscribed. See you in my next videos and goodbye.